Hey, wanna buy some Kush? Hello everyone and welcome to another vlog. This time it's gonna be a little bit different. Well, I told you guys that I was gonna apply for partnership. I applied and I got rejected. Because something tells me that my vlogs are boring the crap out of you guys. This isn't interesting at all. So I'm going to be making a lot more interesting videos from now on. And what is more interesting than Spider-Man and Transformers? And any other sort of pop culture, basically. So um, I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a preview of what is to come from Like Spider David. What I'm going to be reviewing, what I'm going to be doing in general. And um, yeah show it to you guys but before I do I also want to uh, uh, express my views and opinions on the Oscar nominations that were announced on Thursday yeah okay there were some pretty good nominations for best picture best director except for the Dark Knight it did not get nominated so all you people that were tired of hearing the Dark Knight and are all saying that it's too hyped that it's overrated well you got your wish um, but hey, it's a comic book movie. You can, nobody can actually say that it wasn't gonna happen. So, oh, at least it did get eight nominations, which is still a lot. It's the third highest uh, n uh, number of nominations for this year. The highest was, of course, Benjamin Button with thirteen. That was absolutely crazy. It's the second highest uh, number of nominations in history. The highest was Titanic with uh, fourteen nominations. Um, so we might be having a good um. Uh, Oscar season this year, an Oscar ceremony. Um, not to mention also before the nominate before the Oscar nominations, we also had Razzie nominations, which instead of best, it's worst. And um, the Love Guru is the one with the most nominations for worst everything, worst actor, worst screenplay, worst movie, worst director. I still can't believe they have those. Well, that's enough of me. Let's get to the goods of what is uh, what I'm going to be reviewing. So. Let's take a look at that. Alright, so of course, first I'm going to be reviewing the Watchmen comic book. Um, of course, I'm trying to finish it up before the movie actually releases. I am on chapter... I'm in the middle of chapter 10, which is close to the end. Um, and after I'm finished reading it, I'm going to read it at least one more time uh, to kind of recap on the story because obviously I've forgotten what's happened over here at the beginning by now. So except you know I'm gonna skim a few parts. So I'm simply gonna skim it the third, uh, the second time around, then then I'll be reviewing it. And then we I'm gonna do what I call the trilogy D, uh, DVD trilogy reviews, which is of course Iron Man, Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal School, which unfortunately was nominated for worst sequel. But hey, I still like it. I don't love it, but I like it. And of course the Dark Knight DVD. Pretty good. Then we're going to get into some more Transformers, starting with Universe Dinobot. Awesome. Set that there. And then Universe Cheetor. And I don't have them yet, but I'm going to be getting the uh, Hasbro Toy, so Toy Shop exclusive sorry, of uh, Special Edition uh, uh, Optimus Prime. If you don't know how he looks like, go ahead and take a look at that trailer that I posted up, the Coming Soon 2009 trailer, whatever it's called. And there's a little picture there, a little snippet that shows him. You could be be able to take a look at him. And that is practically it in terms of anything new. Now, I know I said that previously I was going to do video game reviews. I might do that, but it's going to be a little bit different. And I'll explain to you why in a minute. But this is what I'm going to be reviewing uh, up next. I hope you guys are looking forward to this stuff. And besides all of this stuff, I'm also gonna be, um, you guys are probably gonna be, you're gonna, you guys are either gonna hate me or love me or at least like me for this. Um, one of the, uh, my guesses as to why I got rejected or uh, for a partnership or maybe it could, uh, create a potential risk to get you know demoted if I do become a partner and then some of them say hey you can't do that um, one of the reasons is because all my pre all my reviews have that opening title sequence with 
uh, Billy Idol's Dancing With Myself, the, song, the title song. And obviously that song is not mine. Even though I'm not taking credit for it, it could still um, be a risk for me to uh, have that up and I'll be screwed. You know, I won't be able to make uh, reviews and all that fun stuff. Uh, because, well, at least I won't be able to become a partner because that is copyright music, as they call it. I already got two reviews, which is the Batman, the Movie Masters Batman and the Movie Masters Joker. I had to delete those because I used little set, uh, you know, tiny little clips of the Dark Knight score in it. And I had to take them down. So, what I'll be doing is, are called Redo Reviews. Every single Spider Man review that I did and every single Transformer review that I, that I did. I'm going to delete. I'm giving you guys a moment to bring it all together. I'm going to del delete it and I'm going to be redoing it. I'm going to be redoing all of my old reviews because let's admit it, uh, just like I said in the, in the, um, in the uh, I think it was the Camp Camtasia Studio 6 video, uh, when I started out, I was very shy in front of the camera and I'm not expressing, you know, I'm not doing all this crazy stuff like I'm doing it right now. Um, so I think maybe if I redo the reviews, not only will they be shorter, so you guys uh, um, will be able to watch them much more efficiently, but I don't know, they'll just be better. That's another thing. My reviews are going to be short. No more part one, part two, part three. No. No more. Just one review per whatever the hell it is I'm reviewing. Uh, what are the things I'm going to be cutting back on? Well, the opening sequence. Yeah, the old one was 47 seconds long. The new one has to be either 30 seconds or less. No more. Uh, no more pros and cons list. Uh, I figured that when I do that, I'm practically saying the same exact thing that I said before throughout the whole review, and it's a waste of time, and it, use, it takes up a lot of time to edit. Uh, no more packaging, no more going over the packaging, unless it's cool, unless the packaging is really good looking, and if it's recent, like for example, the universe figures, uh, uh, the first time I do a universe figure review, I will be going over the packaging briefly. I won't. I'm not gonna point out the little things like there's the Decepticon symbol. You know, I'm just gonna point out the really cool things like this 25 uh, anniversary logo. But actual packaging, no. Uh, no more overview. Uh, overview. Uh, I'm not gonna say where I got the figure unless it's a rare figure um, that you know. I if I know that you guys are gonna flood me with comments and questions where did you get it? how much did it cost then I will point that out but if it's something that you can find easily I'm not gonna bother saying it no more little you know mint conditions uh, like that you know no it's just gonna be one whole review plain straight to the point but thoroughly detailed and I hope you guys enjoyed those new review redo reviews that I'm gonna be doing uh, there are a few reviews that I'm not gonna redo that include uh, movie reviews because the movies are old um, uh, the the reviews between the Spider-Man ones and the Transformer ones, meaning the Darth Vader voice changer helmet, the um, uh, light the little lightsabers lightsaber kit, the little Lego Technic figures, whatever they were. Those are very uh, those those videos hardly get any uh, views or any, even comments or ratings or whatever. So I'm just not gonna do those anymore. Uh, I'm not gonna redo those. I am working on getting a VO account. And maybe instead of redoing them, I might be able to post my movie reviews and my little stop motion films, like these Spider-Man and Bridge Cut films, which I will delete as well. But I'm not uh, uh, because they contain music from the movie. Uh, I am getting. I'm. Um, I am planning on making a VO account. That way, I could take those videos and put them over there, and not having to worry about uh, copyright stuff without. Uh, uh, you know, having to become a partner at the same time, I could just upload them, whatever, and you guys could check them out there. However, I'm having some trouble with the account. Uh, every time I try to press upload or make a channel or whatever, it keeps telling me to uh, confirm my email. So if you guys, if you guys made a VO account and know how to fix that, please let me know because I need some help. Um, another thing that works for my advantage is that reviews and videos are going to be at night now. Um, not only day, I will do them at day, but I'm also going to be able to do them at night because I got some lighting. I got three of these bad boys here at Target. And I'm, and I'm able to get some pretty decent lighting in very dark areas like this. Alright, ah, hot!
Um, anyway, that's practically it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys want to see all this awesome stuff, check this out. You know, all these great reviews that are coming to you guys soon enough. Then please subscribe, post a comment, let me know what you guys think. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys. David out.